We have an aircraft that is looping in a circle. In a vertical circle, we need to find the weight of the flyer of mass m at top, at middle, and at the bottom. So when he says weight, what we mean is apparent weight. That is normal reaction from the seat. So apparent weight is basically you can think like that, that if you are standing on a weighing machine, how much weight it will show. So that is same as the normal reaction. So that's what we need to calculate. What is the normal reaction from the seat that the flyer is going to get? So we'll analyze it with respect to plane because then our flyer will be at rest and it will be easier to calculate the everything. So this thing is a plane and the flyer is sitting on it. So one thing we know is acceleration at all these points is towards center. So if we are observing it with respect to the plane itself, the acceleration of pilot will be towards outside, in outside direction in all the cases. So pseudo force will be mv square by r in outward direction. And the pilot is at rest with respect to plane. So again, the acceleration of plane at all the points is towards center and its value is mv square by r. So with respect to plane, the pseudo force on pilot will be in the outside outward direction. Then the other forces on the pilot are mg and n. So on the bottom it will be like this at center mg downwards and n towards left and on the top n towards so bottom and mg also towards bottom. So now let's write the force equation for each of these cases. So because pilot is at rest with respect to plane, the forces must be balanced. So at lower point, n must be equal to mg plus mv square by r. And in the middle, n must be equal to mv square by r. And on the top, n plus mg must be equal to mv square by r. So that will give the value of our apparent weight.